Ramón es alguien que tiene unos ideales bastante claros. Esta causa era el comunismo, la Unión Soviética y ser parte de algo que pueda ser mucho más grande. Para Ramón, su madre es algo muy importante. Sus ideales se fueron añejando con el paso del tiempo, pero esa semilla fue inculcada por su madre. Una madre que es capaz de renunciar a sus hijos y sacrificarse por su propia ideología y por la ideología de un partido en aras de que en futuro todo sea más justo y funciona mejor. Kotov es una figura paterna. Un gran soldado. Y la precisión, la consideración y la sabiduría que él trajo a su trabajo. Yo play Sylvia Agaloth who is very, very politically motivated, very idealistic. She has a relationship with a man who she thinks is called Jacques Monard. And his relationship with her is all part of a Soviet plot to get close to Trotsky. I think Trotsky for Sylvia was a very important figure for Sylvia. So the fact that Ramon was incorporated to this sequito was merely for cordiality. Trotsky was a clearly obsessive, dynamic, leader. Trotsky thinks about what motivates his enemy, but he's also capable of weeping in that sort of Russian soul way. Actors have three eyes. First eye is the intelligence. That's what you read the script. You talk to the director. You look at photographs. You read books. Second eye is the instinct, which is the choices you make. The third eye is your imagination, and you imagine, which brings together the intelligence and the instinct, and gives it all life. I worked on the personal story, so I tried to recover absolutely all the data that I could about her. I was looking for not only justifications, but also motivations, which is what we work on. Initially, I thought I need to find out everything about her, and quite quickly I discovered that there wasn't a huge amount. So then my main research was more just about Trotsky's writings and Trotsky's ideas. Antonio has been um, wonderfully detailed and challenging to find new things and to find a good interpretation. Antonio tenía mucha información. Yo creo que el guion es bastante claro. Hay una línea bastante clara de hacia dónde va la historia. It's always dangerous when you play a famous person because everybody has a strong image. When a character you are playing existed, you don't impersonate the person. You don't copy them. You become them. What's exciting is no matter how much preparation you do, is the fresh discoveries on the set. No es muy común encontrar una película México España que tenga todo este cast tan rico, ¿no? tantos actores tan generosos, actores tan sensibles. De repente tener la posibilidad de que todos estén unidos en un solo país haciendo un proyecto maravilloso, pues bueno, para mí fue un placer estar ahí.